So if you use ozone for your own mastering and are still a beginner in uh, mastering, maybe it's uh, interesting to have a look at ozone 10. I have already installed it and I think it's uh, even better than the ozone 9 assistant system that I used for, I think, years now. So we have a look at how both compare in context to using the assistant only. I have a Loop Cloud project here. We can have a short look at or a together. It sounds like this. I take a mix down, export into Bitwig Studio. Have another copy for Ozone 10 track. And now we can start the analysis with the assistant. Important is to compare Ozone 9 to Ozone 10. You have to take the manual and the high, and we have also a streaming as target. So, okay, the analysis is done. And now we do the same with Ozone 10. So, I am already in the assistant mode, so we have to take the relearn button to start it. Okay, analysis is done. Now we have a look at Ozone 9. And now compare it to Ozone 10. Back to Ozone 9. And again, Ozone 10. What's interesting, Ozone 10 is a bit more dynamic, not as harsh as Ozone 9 in some frequencies. So if we have a look at the details, so this is Ozone 9. And this is Ozone 10. Back to Ozone 9. So have a look here. It's pretty interesting. 